Hey everyone, this is Dylan, and today I'm going to be doing a movie review for you guys. So the movie I'm reviewing today is... Exists. So, this is actually kind of fun. This is a, like, fake VHS case that I got for this movie from a little site called Rotten Rentals. I'll put a little link to an iCard up there so you can see what it's all about. But I don't have this movie on... Blu-ray, but, or DVD, but I thought that I have this, so I was like, I'll just do that. So Exist was released on October 24th, 2014. It was directed by Eduardo Sanchez, who was one of the original directors of The Blair Witch Project. It stars Dora Madison Burge as Dora, Chris Osborne as Brian, Denise Williamson as Elizabeth, and Brian Steele as Sasquatch. And so, like The Blair Witch Project, this was a found footage movie, and let's kind of just get into it. It's a pretty simple story. Uh, so there's a bunch of friends, there is two couples, and the brother of one of the guys in the cu one of the couples is also tagging along. So there's five people all together, and they decide that for the weekend they're gonna go and to the woods of eastern Texas and hang out and go to their uncle's cabin. So the two brothers, their uncle has a cabin out there, so they're like, hey, let's go. And so they head to the cabin. It's like this all day and part of the night trip to get there from wherever they're at. I'm not particularly sure where they are from. And so they're driving at night and since it's found footage, there's camera rolling and all of a sudden they hit something. They're not sure what it is. So one of them takes the camera, rewinds it, and they see something that looks like a man that got hit, but they're not entirely sure what it was. So they continue on to the cabin. So once they get towards the cabin, they start going down the like driveway to get to the cabin and there's a tree blocking it so they have to walk the rest of the way. And as they are walking, they uh, get to the cabin and they realize that the door is already open, uh, it's kind of cracked a little bit. And when they walk in, it's like really dirty, <laughs> there's like leaves and dirt and dust everywhere. And they're like, well, let's just uh, go back and sleep in the car, and in the morning we will start figuring out what the heck is going on. So then, sometime in the middle of the night, one of the guys wakes up and hears this like screeching, and it sounds like something's really in a lot of pain. And another, the two brothers are the ones that are awake. And they don't really know what to do, so they're like, all right, whatever, just go back to sleep. And so the next day, they go back to the thing, and uh, the one brother, who's kind of like our main character, Brian, he's like, I'm going to hang out around the cabin and like film the woods and stuff because I think there's something out there. They are kind of got this idea that it's a Bigfoot. One of the couples, not the brother, but uh, the other couple, kind of go off and they're trying to do uh, the little, a little dirty stuff. And uh, Brian's like, yeah, I'm going to film this. Um, it's really bizarre. But in the middle of filming it, uh, Bigfoot walks right by. And so they realize that they're not alone. And this Bigfoot is not happy. And so that night... Bigfoot basically attacks the cabin, and so that's where I'm going to leave the synopsis. So let's get into what I liked about this movie. I thought that this was a solid Bigfoot movie. There's not really many movies about Bigfoot, and so I thought that this was a pretty solid movie. I think the Bigfoot costume, well, the Bigfoot, like, creature looks good, acts pretty good. I think for the most part this movie is pretty decent. Uh, then getting into things that I don't like, some of the acting is pretty bad, uh, specifically from the actress who plays Elizabeth. Like, I don't want to single her out, but her acting was just so bad. It was unreal. I just can't believe how bad it was because it was, she, it was basically like line reading. It's like, she was just like, oh my gosh, uh, get me out of here. And I'm just like, you would definitely 
are not reacting like a human being would react. So let's talk about what other people thought of this movie. It has a 2.5 out of 5 on Letterboxd. It has a 30% critic score on Rotten Tomatoes and a 29% audience score. And on IMDb, it has a 5.2 out of 10. So I pretty much liked this movie for the most part. I think it was a pretty solid movie. It was a decent found footage movie. So it did something that was lacking a lot of found footage movies. It like keeps the, if you want to see Bigfoot, this movie has Bigfoot throughout this movie. So it's like you're seeing Bigfoot. It's not like some hidden character uh, like the Blair Witch Project. Things are happening all the time in this movie and it's, it's, a, it's definitely a joy ride for sure. So that is it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you guys for watching and let me know if you've seen Exist and whether or not you liked it. Uh, if you do want to watch it, it is streaming on Vudu, Tubi, Pluto TV, and IMDb TV. And remember, if you're not already subscribed and you'd like to be, please hit that subscribe button down below and give this video a like if you liked it. Thank you guys for watching and have a great day. Bye!